One can also use single antennas to do 4x4 MIMO systems. Um, once again, they need to meet the frequency requirement, just importantly. So you can't just go use the type of antennas that we use for any different type of frequencies. Best example in my case is perhaps LPDA-92. Uh, LPDA-92, we already provide you with a mount that allows you to, normal mount is vertical, so now we're looking from the front. So the antenna is vertically oriented, then we've got a special mount, it's either bracket 33 or 330, that allows you horizontal mount. Then you stay a little bit apart, most probably also about 60, and we've got another mount that allows plus minus 45 degree. So now I've got four LPDAs, take four cables down, and you've got a fantastic hardcore solution, and the LPDA does in fact go up to the frequency bands that we require. Alternatively, you can use, say, for example, Expo, no, sorry, Expo is out, we've already done Expo. You can also use Omnis. Omnis is perhaps the most difficult ones to use. So Omnis, you need four kind of Omnis, once again, hopefully covering all of the bands, all of the bands that you know that you're going to use. Omnis, typically, we're going to be, have on a pole, and whether that's on a ship or yacht or whatever, pole is sort of how we mount these things. Um, and if it's a metal pole, you once again space them, and you can literally space them so that they almost overlap. But space them vertically, but turn them so that if you look from the top, that they're on all sides of the mast. Okay, that just gives you what's known as a bit of pattern diversity as well. Um, but so these ones are spaced going down. The one is sort of here and the other one is there. All of them, they need to, the edges can be, or the tips can be almost at the same point. So one bottom starts with the other one's tip ends. Okay, and I think that's the best to do um, with uh, typical omni antennas, you can in city environments, of course, go mount them next to each other, um, looking from the top, okay, on a building edge, for example, spaced again about 0.6 meters apart.